I've got a tip for you about fish filleting, in particular filleting large fish. Now, whether it's a cobia or a marlin or maybe something like this, good quality jewfish, this can be quite difficult for anyone if you don't have the right tools. For me, I like to use a, a nice knife that's quite flexible on the blade, but at the same time is firm and rigid, so I can get in there and cut around the bones. It's got to be super sharp as well. Let's start filleting this particular fish. This is the pectoral fin, dorsal up top, so I'm going to run my knife on an angle, like so, as you normally do with any fish under the pectoral running behind the head. From there, you just want to turn him around, run the knife up, and I'll show you as I do this, but then I'll bring it back. Is from here, I run the knife about an inch and a half of the knife blade all the way down along the top of the fish like so. Until we get towards the end there, and then push the knife through, but make sure you feel the backbone going underneath the blade, okay? From there, run the knife out. What I'm going to do now is lift up this part of the fish and just slice away, bit by bit, and keeping the bone underneath the knife blade at all times. Move the fish around you so you're comfortable. Otherwise it can become a little bit awkward. When they get to the backbone, chop around that rib cage. Eventually, you'll end up with that. Cut along here. And there we have it. Nice little bit of salt water. Don't use fresh water. Give it a clean up. And away we go, beautiful. Now, if you wanna take the fillet away from the skin, here's another quick way for you. The top end here, always press your finger down, just like so. Nothing too much. Put the knife in on an angle, like so, and slicing backwards and forward. Again, super sharp. Take a firm grip of the skin, and then just keep moving it through like that. It's a big fillet, so we're just gonna keep slicing away with that super flexible, super sharp knife until we get to the end. And there we have it. It's off, and it's done, and there's your skin.